More goblins. Delicious. Time to push my luck again. One on you, two on you. Oh, wow. They're toast. Does that guy, like, not realize that's... What? Why didn't he get into combat with them? That was weird. Not a very sharp eye. With those robbers killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wolves. But first, three more stones. Make it nice and bloody. Yeah! Hit his head! I want to hear more noises. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Cave bear, I'll help you. It's lunchtime. That hurt. Not nice at all. Okay. Wait, why can't I use my all oh, spell slots? Of course it missed. All right. What are we going to do here? Um, Lizelle.
Man, Lazelle could move so far. It's crazy. Also, can't wait till she hits like level five or whatever it is when you get double attacks. Lazelle and Asterion. I'm pretty sure mages don't. Yeah, you run, you little bugger. What? Oh! Oh, it's Grease. Wow. Rip my turn. Uh... Wow, that sucked. <laughs> like, really bad. Gargantuan Cleave. Oh, I should save that for, like, a group of enemies. That's just throwing all the crap around. Jeez. Of course. We'll do it my way. Let's see if you like that. Sprinkle, miss, miss, miss. Bad. Brutal. Time to strike. You bugger. Man, I'm just not doing well with hits tonight. I find that like when you hit like level 10, you just you hit a lot more. What? <laughs> I wiped out. Goblin guts are quite far down the list. You aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> a true friend of nature, or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. Yes, but just Halson will suffice. I'm becoming to demand honorifics from the one who saved my hide. Parasites in your head that... You mean you have one of them? <sighs> Oak Father preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The Mind Flayer's spawn. But... Something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the Absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Perhaps. But I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. You weren't speaking lightly when you said you needed help. Let me tell you what I know. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them, someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for, a way to remove the tadpoles, but I found the next best thing. I found out where they come from. That must be where these enchantments are placed on them. 
And it's where you'll find your cure. I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. Oh, wait, I could help you find a cure. But I need to settle matters here first. I've no right to ask more of you. But if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Rare is the beast that survives decapitation. Help me eliminate the Drow Minthara, the Hobgoblin Draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. They are the ones holding these parasites together. Remove them, and nature will cure itself. There is no safety. Not while this rot festers. Once it is cut out, once the grove is secure, then I shall leave. Be warned. My presence could make things more difficult. I can only restrain my bear form so much. I won't be able to help but attack goblins. If I join you, we'll likely have to slaughter this entire place. You may want to use discretion when approaching the goblin leaders. May Sylvanus guide your hand. I'm going to keep him here for now. That's all it will take to restore the balance here. I'm going to try and talk to Minthara. I don't know if I can. What? <laughs> Stupid grease. I keep getting... Oh my god. There. It's defeated by the environment. This must be like the exit. Oh, it's also a jail. Yeah, this will be the way out. Yeah. So I guess we have to talk to Minthara. I recruited her on one of my playthroughs, but it was like an evil playthrough. I don't actually know if you can. I already see like a red dot over there. I wish you could just like knock her out. I don't know if there's like a any way to do like non-lethal strikes. Okay, so Booyog is... Yeah, she's over there. Come on, then. Yeah, they're all red. Okay. Do bless. Yeah, she's red. Darn. Should have brought the bear with me. I was thinking 
Is there? Oh, non-lethal. thing Alright, lady. You've officially outstayed your welcome. Shoot, what can I do? I don't have a lot of uh, spells left. Critical miss. <laughs> Critical miss. Miss. Critical miss. Jesus. That was uh, really awesome, actually. Apparently he's happy for some reason. So what I'm going to do is knock out Manthara and then leave her here and hopefully she will wake up later. I don't know if they patched that or not or made her so you don't have to kill her. Probably not, but I'll do my best. Man, she's just like dodging everything. Get out of here. Need to act fast. No healing spells left. Can you actually make a build with that? <laughs> so you can actually like hit people? Oh geez, that was like... She healed all of her health back. Sneaky. You lacerate her. Get out of here. Leave my mage alone. Talk to me. Okay, non lethal damage, good. Weird, she's a paladin, but she dual wields. I must heal. Wow, she is. Got it in for me bad. Victory awaits. Down bad for the Dark Urge. I 
can do better. I must. Okay, good. She's just knocked out. Hopefully that's uh We'll run into her in the future. All right, let's sort this uh, by type. All right. So let's hope for the best for Minthara. Maybe we'll run into her in the mountainside, but... I did not want to kill her. I didn't know you could have um, non-lethal attacks. warm-up okay well maybe we'll go grab the bear then because if we're just gonna kill the other guy now what that is oh it's a recipe all right Halson I might need his help for this I know there's a lot of enemies in there with him. Enough sitting around. Let's go hurt someone. Here goes nothing. You need stuff more often. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers. Your hands shake as they reach upward. Your forehead remains drenched no matter how much you wipe. Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest. Gripping your heart, piercing your belly, your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty. A touch of disgust. Advantage. Oh, what? I cannot trust my own mind, so it seems I must trust yours. I will wait, but know this, I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Not 
become a mind flayer. Not while I'm around. I'll protect you. <laughs> Imagine hacking the grubby paw off. What is, is this a dark urge thing? Though the thought crosses your mind, it doesn't hold you. Doesn't devour you, as your thoughts too often can. Your compulsions will doom us all if you do not work to stop them. I can help. We haven't much time, so listen closely. There is great potential within you. It comes from that parasite. Your instinct is to resist the power it gives, but you must accept it. Nurture it. I will keep it from consuming you, but for the sake of both of us, you must learn to wield it. for the fate of Faerun, a fight we are losing for now. You can change that, but only if you embrace your potential. I have to go. The enemy is closing in. I will be back. She's so adorable. I love the halflings. Wake now. You'll feel better. I promise. So you can play without using illithid powers, but you're severely underpowered. I tried that with my pally. Just to see if you get like a special achievement, which you don't. So yeah, like using the powers, you're just so powerful, but yeah, I wouldn't advise it. Ignoring the uh, illithid stuff. I mean, I, there's a thing that happens in act three. We'll talk about when it, the time comes that that's a choice that I don't usually take. Okay. So we're arrested. Got our slots back. So let's get back. All right, where's Halson? Very well. My claws are yours. Alrighty, let's do this. So I like to hide behind this door because they'll eventually all come. They're just a pain in the ass if you go out into the open, obviously. So we're going to lure them. Can't move in there, there's acid. I'm breathing, despite everything. Okay, and then I'm gonna pull back. Oh, I don't wanna get that close. They're gonna knock you off the edge. Can't slow down. It's kinda nice that you use ability, then you turn invisible right away. <laughs> Level five, double turns, that's right. So I'm gonna move you out of the way. My faith will protect me. Let's see if that'll work. Good. I wanna deal with the other guys first. See if I can do menacing attack ranged. On the move. I want to get these guys down here. Well, or up. I can probably hit him from there. Gagrin! 
Level one human. Level five. Oh, he's a hobgoblin? That's what hobgoblins are. So much for that guy. Time for a new approach. What now? Another step forward. Actually, let's use magic missile. Oh, that kind of sucked. <laughs> Jeez. I barely even heard him. Matt, I love hold. It's so good. It's so OP. Do they not have any more? Oh, they got the warlock there. He doesn't even know we're here yet. Let's just stay at the doorway. That's actually kind of funny. You take out, take out the hobgoblin before they even know he's here. Uh, I don't need to heal that bad. Taking position. Disarming attack. Where's that? All right, Narvas. If I can sneak in and get a shot off on him. No, it's too far. However, not too far for this. Let's have it. Goes into battle for the first time, nearly killed. Well, say good night, son. To focus. Got to move. The absolute has been defeated. Give you that. You and Lisa. I couldn't actually target him <laughs> to click on his portrait because he was so far away. Okay, we just got one guy left. One and one more up there. You actually did it. The leader's dead. <laughs> Praise Sylvanus. No, that's not right. Praise you, my friend. The Grove owes you a debt beyond measure. Killing's never my first choice, but those three were too dangerous to leave alive. You sound all but deranged by blood, but I suppose even a feral wolf has a caring hound at heart. Return to the grove. I'll make my own way there. I can see to some matters there, and we can discuss what comes next amidst more bucolic surroundings than here. What does bucolic mean? Yeah, I knew there was one more. Excellent. So that just nerfs your decks, right? That's funny. I fury. I am death. I wonder if she ever, if the voice ever comments about you using um her one ability that misses all the time. What is that? Yeah, sacred flame. Time to rest. 
speak with the dead. Oh, we left someone alive, apparently. On my way. All right, let's see what this guy had. Uncommon melee weapon, versatile. This one is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. You already know how. Your mind swells as it subsumes everything the tadpole has to offer. Everything it was, and everything it was destined to be. Pure potential. Pure power. Good. You have grown your power and improved your chances of survival. Should be a treasure room, I think. My energy wanes. Time to rest. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Sure is. I guess we can sell that. Infernal iron. We'll encumber the dark urge, yeah. Man, I really need to sell some stuff. You know, what we should do is sort by... Wait. There's the loot room. Okay, and uh, well guys, that's it for today. That's it for the Goblin Fort. So we'll head out of here on the next one and head back to the Grove and then move on from there. I think we have to go look for Karlak too. So we actually got a lot of stuff left in this area still, but uh, that's it for the Goblin area. So thank you so much and I'll catch you guys later.